everyone and welcome to my escape. Today we're going to be making a video of tier ranking all the books I read in 2022 in accordance to would I date the characters. So I'll be focusing primarily on like main characters, girl guy, I don't care, and my five categories are I would live and die to worship this person. It is 100% a simp level. I would shoot my shot. I would consider if they shot their shot. I would politely decline, and I would run screaming from this blazing red flag monstrosity. Okay, and as I read some dark romance, I feel like that's going to be a pretty big category. Just because you read it does not mean you want it. I hope everyone has fun in this video. I am very excited to make this. And comment down below if you think I've put someone in the wrong category, because believe me, my type, it's not good. It's not good, so feel free to correct. And I'll try to keep this as spoiler-free as I can. So, The Sweetest Oblivion of the, I think this is the Maid Men series, the first one. This is like Nico and Elena. I feel like in every book, there's a stronger, I have a stronger opinion about one, one person in the relationship, and that's what it's gonna be based off of. So I feel like in this one, what jumps to mind is Nico, and I would run screaming from this blazing red flag monstrosity. Okay, I don't know if he's truly a monstrosity, but he is, he's no, he's a big no for me. That, the, the, the those mafia men, <clears throat> no thank you, do not want that in my life. I like my rights, thanks. All right, the maddest obsession, Christian though, this is literally the same series, and I would shoot my shot. I'd shoot my shot. Okay, he's gorgeous. He's smart. He's cold. I don't know why that's a positive for me that he's cold, but... You know, he's got... I don't know. But I know I would shoot, I would shoot my shot. I would shoot my shot with Christian. And, um, just saying I'm not gonna rank both of them and all of them, but I would shoot my shot with Gianna as well. So, sorry. The Darkest Temptation, I feel like the stronger one of this is Rowan, and that Ronin, I think it's a Rowan or Ronin, something like that. The guy, I would run screaming from this blazing red flag monstrosity. No, 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 no. Never, do not want that anywhere near me. Stay away, stay away. That's a hard no for me. How to Kiss Your Best Friend. I think I'm gonna rank him and I would go, I would consider if they shot their shot. You know, he, he was sweet, he was a patient. You know, I like, I, I loved kayak, so if he wanted to go extreme kayaking, I would be down. Like, I could just take his class to do that. I don't know if I would really like love to be in a relationship with him, but you know what, if he shot a shot with me, I might consider it. It happened one summer, Brendan, I would shoot my shot. I would shoot my shot. I don't know why. I don't have a good explanation on that. That was just a knee-jerk reaction and I'm sticking with it. Hook, line, and sinker, I would politely decline. If it was either Hannah or Fox, but my mind immediately went to Fox, I would politely decline. He's a little bit too insecure for me in the sense of I find him annoying and I don't care about his boundaries. Sorry. Your dad will do. I would shoot my shot with Shane. I would shoot my shot with Shane. Try saying that five times fast. But yes. Okay. We're just gonna leave that there, but yes. Gifting me to his best friend. I would politely decline all three of them. I don't remember their names. I didn't love this one. I didn't love any of the characters. So I would politely decline all three. Not for me. My dad's best friend. Okay, well, whoever she was, the main character, like the girl main character in this one, I would consider if they shot their shot. If it was the man, I don't think I would. He just goes seem kind of like blah to me. But she, I remember she was straightforward, good communicator, um, and she was like head of this like giant architecture firm or something. So yes. Or would I shoot my shot with her? No, I would consider. I would consider if she came and shot her shot with me, I would consider her. Um, seducing my guardian, I would politely decline both of them. 
neither of them really like jumped out as traits like I love and they were yeah no so that happened I feel like if he shot his shot with me I would consider just because he does have like really good relationships with his family and like that to me points to like a certain level of like emotional maturity and competency um when you when you have a healthy family um so like he has some green flags so i would consider if he shot his shot i would not go out of my way to find him though baking with benefits okay to pick one if josh shot his shot i would consider it because i like josh and i like his emotional development his like willingness and desire to help other people we're here for all of that so if josh shot his shot i would consider it if luke was acted i would politely decline if layla shot i would consider i would consider okay she's very girl boss-esque eloise and the grump next door i would politely decline both politely decline both okay focusing on him primarily he's judgy he's grumpy i mean it's literally called the grump next door but like He's grumpy for no reason and he doesn't learn from past mistakes and he just seems very he's not good at communicating and he seems very immature so no politely decline both of them a court of thorns and roses if what's her name freya Thea, Thera, something like that i would shoot my shot with her yeah because she's just She's very confident, she's very confident, and she's very selfless. And I would I would shoot my shot with her. A court of mist and fury, Reese. I would consider if he shot his shot, primarily because I would want to be part of like his inner circle, because I love all of them. Um, but like him specifically, I'm not going out of my way to find. Sorry, he just doesn't strike me as that special. Come for me in the comments if you want. Go for it. Okay, praise Emerson. <clears throat> I would consider. I would consider. I might shoot my shot with him, but I would definitely. I would definitely consider. Actually, more than that, I would say yes if he came and asked me out, but I wouldn't go to the next tier and say I would go up and ask him out. But I would, I would go up with him if he if he approached. Eyes on me. That's all. Polite decline. That's a no. That is a no. Neither one of them. Mm -mm. Emotionally stunted, immature. Don't like it. Give me more. I would shoot my shot for all three of them. Specifically, I think Hunter. But all three of them I would be shooting a shot. Uh, Mercy? No. I would run screaming from this blazing red flag monstrosity that is Bo. He's immature. He can't communicate. He's annoying as crap. He doesn't redeem himself. No, no, no. Kings of Chaos. Um, I remember, I think his name was Knox. This is like the one, I, there's like, there's like four of them. Um, I'm gonna put what would run screaming from this blazing red flag monstrosity because I'm pretty sure he like just like in their like first meeting or something like that he just like walked up and like cut her back and they had sex after that and I'm just like no no please stay away from me you know everyone can do what they do that's not for me you stay over there thank you so would run screaming for sure the ash princess that's a lot of drama there. Okay, well, both of the men are boring, so I would I would politely decline both of them. Maybe her, but there there's still like a lot of drama with her. I would politely decline all three. It ain't for me. To make monsters out of girls, no. Politely decline. She did not learn her lesson, and is just so trapped on her first relationship. Still, not about it wretched or wretched hmm. I would shoot my shot with her but she seemed like a fun time 
because she was like a little evil and she was very smart very competent and she just seems like an all-around yes so i would shoot my shot with her the anti-relationship year i would politely decline both of them annoyed me both of them annoyed me so much no thank you the stopover absolutely not would run screaming not even because he's scary just because I'm gonna put the takeover in this one too because I honestly don't remember which one is which. I know one of them's like Tristan and the other one's the other brother. But no, they were both arrogant, annoying, condescending, belittling, stupid. I just know. Just know on both of them. The roommate? I would shoot my shot. Josh? I would shoot my shot. He's so like kind and giving and he he has dreams and aspirations and he just wants to make his industry better and he has like the determination to follow it through when he's given the opportunity so josh i would i would shoot my shot for sure hellfire politely i don't remember his name but i would run the screen because there's a <clears throat> no thank you you can keep your shadows to yourself that's not my world that's not my life <laughs> sorry <laughs> goodbye i would run screaming good book but not he's not for me birthday girl i would politely decline i know everyone's like obsessed with ike but he seems like he's been stuck at 21 for you know 16 years or whatever the age difference is and he's very like he just jumps to conclusions he doesn't wait for an explanation and at his age he should be a better communicator at this point so i would politely decline we don't have time for poor communicators. To kill a kingdom, I wouldn't be going anywhere with him because he's too foot out the door already. He wants to be a pirate. Bro's not going to stick around. He's always chasing the next best, best thing. So wouldn't even be worth it for him. I'm trying to think about her. I feel like I would consider with her just because I can't think of a good reason not to. So I would consider if she shot her shot with me. Shadow and the Ember. Okay. If both of them or either of them shot their shot with me, I would. You know what? No. I would shoot my shot with Mythos. I would. I would probably shoot my shot with Sarah too. I didn't like the book, but I would shoot my shot with either one of those. Of them. Fine print. I would run screaming from this monstrosity. Again, not because he's scary, but because I don't like his actions. I don't like, he's just, he's up, he's, <sighs> didn't like it. I didn't like it. He is a workplace harassment suit waiting to happen. Don't want, don't want anywhere near that. Throne of Glass, I would shoot my shot with her. I would shoot my shot with her. With the main girl and with the princess that they keep visiting, I would shoot my shot with both of them. Because they're just, they're amazing. The, the head general, whatever his name is, I can't remember. I would consider if he shot his shot with me. Dorian, I would probably go. The Shadow of the Twins. I would politely decline just because I don't think our morals would align that well. I.e., I'm not trying to be the next colonial empire and they both are, so that's going to be like no for me. Becky Pierce is, I'm going to run away from that. I can't, I don't even really remember. I read this right at the beginning of the year. All I remember is that I hated it. And I hated, like, I just hated it. So I feel like I hated it. So I can't actually remember. I remember they, like, danced in the kitchen. But I'm gonna go with, I would, you know what, I'm gonna go with I politely declined. Because nothing off the top of my head I can really say is a fault of theirs. So then the Sea Witch, I would run screaming. Because... They have no respect for the people around them, around them. They have no boundaries, nothing that they're not willing to cross. And these are supposed to be the people that they love. So, no. No. Carval, I would run screaming just because the red flag is how boring they are. That is the red flag there. They are so boring and I don't care. And I definitely, I wouldn't, I wouldn't make it through a date with them. I wouldn't make it. The Beast, I would shoot my shot. 
I would choose the charm, yeah, with all three of them. Um, yeah, I'm not going to get any more of that. Yes, let's see here. The Cruel Prince, Jude. I would live and die to worship Jude, okay? I would live purely for one second to be in Jude's presence. That's all. That's all I need. That's all I want. I don't even think I could handle more, more than one second because I would just drop dead because I wouldn't know how to, like, exist in the same realm as her. She's incredible. Incredible. Yep. Yep. Oh, and she's my first. I would die for this person. Okay. Wrath from Kingdom of the Wicked. I would shoot my shot. I would shoot my shot because really... Yeah. I can't get into Hawaii without exposing some stuff, but... Yeah. Defy the Night. Um... I would politely decline if he shot his shot because he just seems very much like he doesn't know who he is and he doesn't have like a strong moral compass yet or like a strong sense of these are the values I'm going to stand for. I feel like he might get there. I haven't read the sequel yet so like maybe he reaffirms himself but I just I don't feel like he knows himself well enough yet to then go and try to enter a relationship with someone. The Iron King. Um, I would consider, I would consider if both Robin or whatever the Ice Prince's name is, I would consider I feel both of them if they shot their shot. I would consider both for different reasons, but I don't think I would consider her both. A worthy opponent? I would consider. You know what? That man, he knows what he wants. And he's willing to put in the work and he has the patience so i would consider him. these hollow vows i would shoot my shot with her she has a strong sense of self a strong sense of family and she seems like fun so i would shoot my shot with her be there with you guys probably not the bridge kingdom oh i would shoot my shot i would shoot my shot with both of them but primarily laura Laura. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Serpent and devil. I would run screaming from this train wreck. No. Do not like either of them. And she's everything about it. No. No, no. Neon God. I would shoot my shot. Primarily with Hades, I would be shooting my shot. He has a strong, like, he's very grounded in what he does is worth it because of the people who benefit, not himself. So I respect and appreciate that and I wish you much help. Yes. Also, we love a leader whose community loves them because that's very telling of the type of leader and the type of person you are. Electric Idol, I would run from this blazing red monster. No, no, whatever his name is, I think he starts with an E. I'm not about it, okay? He has such severe mommy issues, I'm not gonna get over it. <laughs> no, stay away. A Touch of Darkness, I would run screaming because I just remember, like, there was this one section where Hades did something that made me really, 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 really angry, and I was like, get away, get away. And no, I don't want that in my life. Stay away. Stay away. Forbidden Flame. Like, I feel like maybe not him, but I would consider her. Wait Hot Kiss. I would shoot my shot with Roth. I think his name is Roth. Um, I would shoot my shot with him. I think the other guy's name is Zade. I would politely decline Zade. Okay, Zayd is too up on his high horse about things. Roth seems fun, very reasonable, very analytical. Like, he's wondering why he's doing stuff rather than just doing it. Zayd. But, yeah. I would, I would shoot my shot with him. Storm and Fury. I would consider if she asked me, 
because I do kind of remember liking her. And also, because she seems super powerful and like it would be fun. Like, you can get a story out of it. But again, not him. From Blood and Ash, the way I would absolutely worship Poppy. Absolutely worship Poppy. Worship the ground she walks on. That girl deserves the world. I would 100% live and die for her. Anything. Anything she wanted, anything she needed, I got you. I love her. I love her. Hawk on the other hand. I would consider, but it would truly be like a consideration because he doesn't really do it for me. Crank. I would politely decline. They're just, neither one of them are really my, my ballpark in the terms of we don't. We just wouldn't connect on anything, and I don't have any interest in getting in getting to know them better. Sinners condemned. I would shoot my shot with everything. I don't know about him. I might consider, but mm, no. He seems a little unhinged. I don't think I would consider him. I would consider her though. She seems like her brother. Heartless. I would politely decline, I think. Actually, you know what? I would consider if, what's his name, Cade? If he shot his shot, I would politely consider, primarily because he did show in the story that he is a good communicator and really does work things through. Plus, he's got the strong sense of family. He doesn't have a strong identity. Like, he just doesn't maintain that balance well. So I just don't know. So I would, I would consider getting to know him better. I just don't know. Twisted emotions. Oh yes. I love, you know, I love how controlled he is. I love how just direct in his communication he is. Don't know if I'd really worship him. So maybe this isn't his category so maybe i would i would shoot my shot but it would be like a strong it would be like a strong shot for nino and it would be like for the long haul twisted pride i would run screaming from this blazy red monstrosity no 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 it crosses so many lines does so many things that he cannot come back from stay away from me. Keep Re Remo, Remo, keep him away. I don't know. No, 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 no. Meet me halfway. Um, I would politely decline him because he is annoying. He is very judgy when he shouldn't be. And I just don't understand how he is on his high horse for no reason. And I don't appreciate people that judge without any context or idea of what their intentions are. So, no. Hard no. The Predator, I would run school. What is his name? Tristan or something like that? I don't know. He is a no from me. And I feel like she's also a no from me. But he... He's got, oh, he got issues. He's got massive issues. I think her, I might just politely decline, but him, I would run away. One percent of you, I would politely decline. I did like him more towards the end, but again, he's kind of in this with the guy of like meet me halfway, where he was very judgy out of the gate for no reason. And again, coming from a background where it doesn't even make sense that he would be judgy, so again, we don't like judgy people. As I say, judging all of these people. Okay, then we have Ignite. I would consider if they shot their shot. I would consider. I don't know if it would be like a long-term thing, but it might be fun. Taste? No. I would politely decline. Both of them irritated me. Both of them were holding on to grudges for no reason. And holding on to dislikes that wasn't even founded. So, no. Tease. I would consider if he shot his shot. 
feel like I wouldn't consider it. I would politely decline her, but he shot his shot. I, I just I just felt an understanding of him, so maybe there might there might be connection there. But he also is a little little immature, so but like so am I, so maybe it was a attempt. <clears throat> I would probably shoot my shot with him. Yeah. Yeah, we'll leave that there. I would, I would shoot my shot for him. The seventh circle. Okay, I would shoot my shot for Hades for sure. Cheese. Yes. 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 I don't know about the other three. I don't care. But for her, yes, I would shoot my shot. Captured by a sinner. Um. I would consider just because of his general attitude towards his family and as well as like his attitude towards women and his respect of boundaries and yeah I do actually like him it is like some I mean he is a mafia man so it's not great but I would I would consider I feel like he, he wouldn't be setting up there I've been careless with a delicate thing. I would shoot my shot with, um, I don't remember either of their names. <laughs> and they both have the same pronouns, so that does not help. The one who they were at the apartment of all the time, him. I would shoot my shot with him. Um, the other one I would probably consider if he shot his shot with me, but the one where they were always at his apartment. Yeah, there was just something about him. Yeah. He Haven, I would politely decline. I don't need to be up in that mix. I really don't. Omega's obsession. <laughs> the one that starts with an R, that's like a little, a little unhinged. I would consider. <laughs> I'm sorry. I apologize. I would consider. Miss Born. Um, her. You know what? If she shot her shot, if she actually shot her shot, I would consider. I don't see it happening at all, but I would consider just because I'm, you know, if she's coming to ask me out, she's already so about me. And I, you know, I appreciate attention, so I would consider. Cherry bomb? No, I would politely decline. Both of them are messy, messy. Just messy. No. Midnight kiss? I would run screaming from him. You know, you can use me right away. No, I just don't like it. Does not make me feel comfy. No. Lana? The way I would worship at Lana's feet. Anna Myers would live and die, would live and die to worship her. Anything, everything she made, does not matter. I'll do it, I'll make it happen. Just, yes. Desperate measures, I would consider. I feel like I might even consider both of them. But primarily her, because she has a strong sense of self. She's just strong, and I appreciate and respect her, and if she shot her shot with me, yes, it would be a yes. The doctor, I would politely decline. I think his name's like Dr. Swain. Just, maybe that would have been a little bit for me, so politely decline. Bitten by death, I would consider just because he has like, like 20 or like, a random number of essentially docs. I know they're not docs, they're people, but essentially they're docs that can just appear whenever. And I kind of love that. So I would, I would consider on that basis. Frost? I would, would I shoot my shot? With her, I think yes. I like her. And she's kind of chaotic, kind of messy, 
but like messy in a fun way, not messy in like a cherry pop way. <laughs> so I'm gonna shoot my shot here. The haunting, haunting Adeline runs from you so fast, literally so fast. Get me out of there. Get me away from Xavier Andrews. Ugh. No, 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 don't line up with everything that you're told about them and their morals in the sense of like their actions don't line up with the personalities that were described or their actions do not follow through on like what their efforts entail so there's just very like conflicting hypocrisy there that i just don't want to get involved in there's for the night a politely decline there seems like there's other drama there and i just don't care enough about any of the characters to get involved in that drama or to find out more Hush darling, I would shoot my shot with him absolutely. Absolutely. Just sorry not sorry. Him and his dog fell in the ca cabin? Yes. <laughs> Done. With force, I would politely decline. Both of these characters talk and focus so much on like chewing. And having food and other like substances on your scrubs and now you're just like going over and I get because like they're comfortable with each other but they would it just seemed gross to me it grossed me out I got, got the ache from both of them so no just no fantasy league absolutely not what an immature un like it, it does not have a single communication bell in this entire book not in this entire book what no, absolutely not. Oof. Big ick. Big ick for me. The Brutal Prince, I would politely decline. My rights would be in question, you know? Just no thank you. Dirty Little Secret, I would politely decline. I really think he came out of nowhere and was just like, I really, like he's, he's he gives me the vibes of, could be a person, could be a cow. I don't care. I'm still gonna do it. You know, he gives me those vibes. So, no thanks. And the Spanish love deception, I would shoot my shot with him. He was just sweet and persistent and cute and funny and yes. Yes, yes, yes. Carnival of Souls, I would politely decline. They're all boring. They're just all boring. Don't want any part of that. Nope. The kids quotient, I would politely decline as well. I just, I don't think she's looking for a relationship or truly looking for anything. Like she's doing it for her mom and him, he just doesn't do it for me. He doesn't have enough of determination, I guess, to follow through on like his dreams. So I'm just gonna go with no. I sacrifice. Another no. They're just, they all boring. I don't want to get involved. House of Lies and Sorrow? Maybe her. I feel like if she shot her shot, I would consider it. Just because she is like a little bit intriguing and like curious. I like curious people. Um, so I would, I would, I would consider her. Ruthless Demon King, I think I would politely, you know what, if he shot his shot, I would consider, what do I know about him? Not a whole lot, really not anything, other than it would be an interesting date, at the very least, at the very least. The Never King, I think I would politely decline all clear, honestly. Maybe the girl, but like, I feel like I would decline all of them. And definitely the four guys. I'm not really attached to any of them. Okay, Twisted Love, I would want to scream for me. Okay, what the, what the F is he? Actually, you know what? In the end, I would just politely decline. In the beginning, I would just want to scream for him. But like, if I knew everything at the end of the story, I would just politely decline. The man can grow, but does not make up for anything else. Twisted Games, I would politely decline. Just not my vibe. Not my not my my thing twisted hate 
I was on school reading from Josh. Are you kidding me? No, no, huge red flag. All around, all around, there is. No, thank you. Stay with Christian. I'll run away from him. Who? What? Why? No. No. I just... <laughs> Men's is psycho and not in a fun way. So... But how did we do? Because that's all, that's all my rankings. So actually, I kind of thought I would run screaming from more of them. That it might be a little concerning that I'm considering some, some messy characters. But it is what it is. I would politely decline most of them, or like mo more in this category than it seems like the others. And these three are my, I would live and die to worship this person. I don't know why in my mind I thought they would be more in this category, but this makes sense to me that it is been, it's Jude, Poppy, and um, Lana. They are my three goddesses of 2022, whatever you want to call it. They're my three main. And that concludes my wrap up of the people I would like to date versus the people I would run away from. I hope you guys had fun. I know I had fun making this. This, this video definitely took me longer to film than I thought it would, so I really had to go. But this was fun, and I hope you come back for more content. <laughs>